Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and it's a new release week for Blu-ray and 4K, so here is everything that is coming out for September 1st, 2020. If you're new to the channel, please hit the like button, subscribe, hit that bell notification. You can also find me over Twitter, Instagram, and Letterboxd at MovieGuy365. Okay, September is almost here, and it is Tuesday tomorrow, so let's talk about everything that is coming out on Blu-ray and 4K. Now, I have to say, uh, the release schedule for Blu-ray and 4K for the last couple months due to COVID has been really bad. It's been very sporadic and not a whole lot coming out, especially if you're a 4K fan. But... I'm really under the impression that things are starting to turn around a little bit as far as home releases go. If you look at the release schedule for September, October, November, there's a lot coming out. Yeah, a lot of it is not quote unquote new stuff as far as like theatrical run goes, but there are quite a few things being released and uh, it, it, it's a pretty consistently heavy schedule for September. I'm, I'm excited to talk about this. Let's not waste any time. Let's dive right in. So one of the big releases is coming from Warner Brothers, and that is going to be The Goonies on 4K. Now, Blu-ray has been out for a number of years, but this is getting a 4K master restoration. We're getting the standard slipcover edition, which will be available at all your local retailers and online, as well as a Best Buy exclusive Steelbook edition, which of course will be available at Best Buy and uh, online services from them. Now you can also pick up a special edition exclusive gift set. Uh, Amazon's your best bet for that one, which includes like a map and a couple other trinkets that will be included uh, for the 4K release. So the 4K release of the Goonies is promising to be a very special uh, release uh, for this week. So check that one out and let me know which version you plan on picking up in the comments below. Also being released by Warner Brothers in 4K is going to be Tim Burton's Beetlejuice. That is coming to 4K and that will also be getting a standard slipcover edition. Once again, available at all your retailers and online as well as a Best Buy exclusive steelbook, of course. So that one also is going to be available tomorrow. We are also getting another gift set for this one as well, which includes a couple collectible items, including chalk um, for those collectors are looking for that one. Um, it also includes a special, you know, edition for the, um, the cover of the movie, you know, looking like the book of the recently deceased and a couple other things included in that set. Amazon, once again, is your best bet to pick that one up. And I'm excited for that. Uh, this release, Beetlejuice, is one of my favorite Tim Burton films. I'll be picking up the Steelbook edition, but let me know what you plan on picking up in, in the comments below. Uh, also from Warner Brothers in the 4K front is going to be the Robert Downey Jr. Sherlock Holmes movies. Both of these are getting a release tomorrow. Just a slipcover edition. No steelbooks or any exclusives for this one. This one will be available at your local retailers and online places like Amazon or Deep Discount. So check that one out. Uh, I'm a fan of these films. I'm anxious to check these out on 4K. So let me know if you plan on picking those up. Also on the 4K front, uh, Arrow Video is releasing Vin Diesel in Pitch Black. That is coming tomorrow. So that one, it's, since it's an Arrow Video, that may show up at a Best Buy. Uh, I would not expect to see that one at Target or Walmart, but you can also definitely order that one from Amazon. I have my copy coming from Amazon. I'm very excited to check that one out. Uh, it's one of my favorite Vin Diesel films. Uh, I'm a big fan of it. So let me know if you plan on picking this one up in 4K. Also coming out tomorrow is Irresistible, starring Steve Carell and directed by Jon Stewart, formerly of The Daily Show. That is being released by Universal Pictures. So that's probably one of the newest releases coming out. It was available on digital a couple weeks back. So this is getting a physical fork, or I'm sorry, a physical Blu-ray release that'll be available locally tomorrow. I would expect to see this readily at your local store. So if you're not interested in picking this one up online, definitely go out to your local Walmart or your Best Buy and this should be in the store, no problem. Also coming out tomorrow is the Megan Fox action film Rogue, where she plays a mercenary. Sure. Um, being released by Lionsgate Films. Uh, this is going to be released tomorrow. Um, once again, locally, uh, I would expect Walmart and Best Buy to have this one, no problem, maybe even Target. Uh, but also you can pick this one up on Amazon. Let me know if you plan to check this one out or if you're brave enough to check this one out. Um, also coming out, uh, a couple of films from RLJ, uh, Blood Quantum, a horror film from 2019 is getting a release tomorrow. 
RLJ stuff, I'm not usually showing up in stores. It's been known to, like on your uh, occasional Walmart or your Best Buy run, but if you're interested in that one, your best bet is probably to pick that one up online at Amazon. Also coming out is Terrified from RLJ Entertainment, another horror film from 2017. That one, once again, uh, your best bet is probably to pick that one up online. Uh, the Delta Force, starring Chuck Norris from 1986, is getting a release tomorrow. This one I would expect to be online only, so check that one out. It has been years since I've seen the Delta Force. I know my dad was a fan of Chuck Norris. Uh, we used to watch those films a lot, so uh, let me know if you plan to pick that one up. So yeah, Delta Force is coming to Blu-ray. Uh, Z from RLJ uh, Entertainment is coming out tomorrow, a horror film for 2019. That is coming out, so... Uh, once again, RLJ stuff may or may not show up in stores, but uh, that is going to be available. Children of the Sea from Shop Factory, an animated feature from 2017, is getting a release tomorrow as well. Uh, I have not seen this one. Let me know if you plan to pick this one up and what your thoughts were of the film. Baba Yaga, Terror of the Dark Forest, which is probably the coolest title I have ever heard for a horror film, is coming out from Shout Factory tomorrow. That's from 2020. Uh, I have not seen this one. I don't think m many people have, but let me know if you plan to pick this one up. And quite a few things from Kino Lorber are being released tomorrow. Now, with most Kino Lorber stuff, you're gonna, your best bet is going to be to pick this one up online for the Blu-ray. So let's dive in for these. Uh, Britannia Hospital, uh, 1982 film starring Malcolm McDowell is getting a release tomorrow. Uh, the Raging Moon from 1971, also starring Malcolm McDowell, is getting released. I have not seen either one of these. Uh, these might be worth checking out. I'm a big fan of Malcolm Dowell, so I might go back to some of his earlier work and check that out. But let me know if you plan to, uh, once again, pick these up. Black Gravel, uh, a noir film from 1961, is getting a release tomorrow. I've not seen this one. Uh, the Mirror Cracked, uh, Angela, Angela Lansbury mystery movie from 1980, is getting a release uh, from uh, Kino Lorber, so check that one out if you're interested. Uh, John Cleese film Clockwise from 1986 is getting a release and, you know, good comedy stuff from John Cleese. Let me know if you plan to pick that one up. Death on the Nile based off the Agatha Christie and, of course, they're remaking this one starring Kenneth Branagh and directed by Kenneth Branagh. But, of course, due to COVID, I think they were trying to time these releases together. But the, the original is getting a release on Blu-ray tomorrow from Kino. And Evil Under the Sun, a 1982 crime drama, is also getting a release tomorrow. So let me know if you plan on picking up any of these Kino lower titles. So a couple titles being released from Vinegar Syndrome tomorrow. Uh, you'll be able to pick those one up on Amazon. That's your best bet of uh, acquiring these Blu-rays. Uh, the first title is going to be The 11th Commandment. A 1986 thriller is getting a release. As well as Perfect Stranger, a drama featuring a hitman from 1984 is also coming out tomorrow. Uh, I've not seen either one of these, but let me know if you plan to pick either one of those up. The Living Dead at Manchester Morgue, a 1974 Steelbook edition, is coming out tomorrow. That one is readily available for pre-order on Amazon's site, so check that one out if you're interested. Cut Off uh, from MPI, a thriller from 2018, is coming out tomorrow. Uh, that smaller uh, studio title may show up at Walmart. They tend to uh, stock some of those uh, movies on Blu-ray uh, for sale, but uh, I would not expect to see that one really in stores. But hey, check it out. Let me know if you see it in Walmart. Uh, Odd Man Rush, a 2020 film from Gravitas Vertra Ventures is coming out tomorrow. It's a sports film. Uh, I don't really know much about this one, but this is getting a release. Uh, but I would say Amazon's your best bet. Uh, coming out for TV tomorrow is going to be Young Sheldon Season 3. That is getting a release. A uh, spinoff from The Big Bang Theory is coming out tomorrow. Let me know if you plan to pick that one up. I haven't actually, I think I've seen like one episode of the show, but uh, I never really went back to it. But let me know if you plan on picking that one up. And there's also a couple movies coming out at the end of the week. So this one's not going to be released on Tuesday. But it's showing up on Amazon's site. Rather pricey, by the way. But um, Ava, starring Jessica Chastain, is coming out on September 4th. Uh, once again, Amazon has that up for pre-order. It's about $40, $42 or so. Uh, I don't know if the price is going to change or what the deal is with that uh, actual cost, but let me know if you plan to pick that one up. That one will be available on September 4th. And a couple two-packs are coming out on September 6th. Uh, the Goosebumps 2-pack featuring both movies is coming out from Sony, as well as the, the original McG Charlie's Angels movies are getting a double-pack release. So both of those... Uh, Blu-ray sets are coming out on September 6th. 
That is everything coming out on Blu-ray and 4K. Things are starting to look a little bit more back to normalish this week. Let me know what you plan on picking up. I've got my eye on quite a few things, so I'll be reviewing those for the channel, so stay tuned for that. But let me know in the comments below what you plan on picking up this week. In the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. So until next time, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.